showing you guys how to add an external keyboard if you have a English standard keyboard or any other types of uh, languages depending on where you are on earth. From the first thing you're going to do is you're going to type in keyboard on your Macintosh computer in your search bar. From there it's going to pop up into your accessibility which will show pretty much a couple other options if you wish to change them. From there you're going to go into keyboard settings keyboard settings it's going to deploy into keyboard from there it has a couple other settings you could adjust like the brightness a bunch of other types of uh, things that uh, you might be interested in from there you're going to go into your text input from there import sources hit edit and then if you wish to have your keyboards at the very top right here uh, click on show input menu in menu bar and I'll add it up here so you can just change to the actual keyboard layout that you wish to um, use. From there, you're going to, if you don't have any other layouts, if you just have a standard US or whatever it is, from there, you'll use the positive sign. Negative sign deletes the keyboard, so hit the positive sign. From there, you can choose any of the other types of languages that you wish to add to your keyboard. So for example, if you wish to speak in Japanese, this is the Japanese standard keyboard. From there, you could choose from Kana or Romanta. From there, uh, if it's uh, it's easier to speak, you know, this way, uh, you know, it's just depending on like uh, the type of uh, you know keyboard you're using. There, you'll add it, and then from there you'll hit done. And then, other than that, uh, there's a couple of touch bar settings, uh, text replacements, and this is just with microphone. If you wish to like speak to Siri in a different language, you hit add languages. Then pretty much your input source is obviously your Macintosh, or if you've got an external microphone from there, that's about all the information that you need to know. Other than pretty much when you click it up here, then you want to go to Japanese or whatever other languages, you're going to hit open Japanese uh, Cantana, actually no, wait, uh, show keyboard viewer. From there, it'll pop it up, and then pretty much if you want to type in, like, good example, let me go back to... Uh, English just to pull up my notepad real fast. So let's go to new notes. Okay, from there it'll uh, pretty much give you the ability to type in like the language just depending on the keyboard you hit, or I mean the keys you choose to hit. And it'll give like uh, auto corrects if you're not spelling things correctly. I hope this uh, video was uh, a little bit uh, of a tutorial that helped you. Uh, locate this uh, in a fashionly manner and I hope you guys have a good rest of your day. Bye!